Hello Transformation, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be doing some boho braids with Free Tris Beach Curl and Gala Braids. Ooh, yes, I know the child is head of mine. Ooh, but we're going to get it done, I promise you. So I did a little bit um, off the camera. So I was showing you guys what I did so far. Um, I did the rubber band method um, to make sure the sections of my hair are completely neat. So I'm going to take my neat braid gel. So this is the braiding gel that I am using to section my hair in each row. <laughs> um, I'm sectioning my hair and as you guys can see, making sure that I'm getting to my roots, making sure that it's flat as possible and very neat and clean. And this is how I did the braid so far. So make sure I'm brushing that gel in from the roots. So I'm just brushing, 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 brushing. So now I'm gonna take my rubber band, you guys. And then once I do that, we're gonna start braiding. So I'm taking this rubber band to help section my hair to make it neat because I can't really see um, once I braid because I don't know if it's going to pucker up at the root when I braid. So I just make sure that it is tight. I'm not tugging on it too tight and I'm using a bigger rubber band, not the small rubber band. I'm using the big rubber band like I did before. So I... <laughs> I have some hair right there behind me that I had uh, sectioned off. So I'm using the Gala Braids. It is, it's so soft and thick, you guys. I love it. I think I use seven out of eight. I ordered me some more. But I use seven packs out of eight for this style here. So right now I am braiding the hair and I'm using the neat J, the neat J, <laughs> the neat braid, so it can look very smooth. So I really have been like trying to move fast because that hair start tangling towards the bottom. So, and this braiding hair is hyperallergenic. So if you're looking for some braiding hair, um, please go to Gala, G Y A L braids.com i will leave the description in my bio well not my bio in below this video and i'm showing you guys how i'm braiding as you guys can see i was trying to show you guys and also i'm going to braid some more i'm trying to braid from my hair a little bit so now I'm going to be adding some pieces for you guys so this is the hair I'm using I'm using free Tris beach curl so I cut the hair in half where it was looped and I'm easily like sectioning off the hair so I'm making it like really thin because I know the hair is synthetic so I don't want to be so bunched up so I'm making it look as natural as possible um, I wasn't going to spend too much money on no hair that I'm just going to add pieces in. It's human hair. Um, add human hair. And yeah, most of the human hair has been shedding. That's crazy. So I said, I'm going to try this beach curl. I love the texture of it. It matches the texture of the hair that I'm using. So as you guys see, I'm holding it with my mouth. And I did clean the hair before I put it in my head, you guys. The braiding hair and the loose curl. So I'm just braiding in in the middle to hold it in place. And I'm adding the neat braid gel as I braid because I want the braid to look very smooth and not rough. So I'm just braiding and braiding. And I was so happy because I learned it in a couple of weeks of how to do this boho look. Because um, at first I was kind of skeptical. I was nervous and I was anxious. I said, well, maybe I can crochet. But I know next time that I will use a better quality of hair. So I am braiding the beach curl. So I am braiding. I'm adding the section in the middle 
So I am using Preacher's Beach Curl uh, 12 inch and I'm just going to keep braiding until I want to add a little bit more hair and keep on. I just keep braiding and braiding. So as you guys see, it's very easy. It wasn't hard at all. It took me about six hours because I had to part my hair. Well, I washed my hair and I had to part it. That's what took up most of the time is me parting the hair to have it um, neat and not have to part uh, cricket. So, I mean, it was very easy. So, I'm just showing you guys what I did. So, just adding that braid, starting the braid, adding. Just add it in the middle section, and then that's it. And I love how the hair felt. It didn't feel crunchy at all. It was very nice. And I love I love beach curl. I would definitely use beach curl again. But um, this is like one of my favorite styles so far. I didn't do small, you guys. I did medium. If I did small, it might have took me about eight hours, to be honest with you. But I only did like a medium size. It took me six hours. And this was so easy to do. So I'm going to take another piece and I'm going to add it in the middle. And I'm just so proud of myself. I learned how to do this technique. I've just been on YouTube doing it. And I just love doing my hair different styles. And um, just letting it breathe. So I'm just braiding it down. All the way down. And I'm using that neat braid gel once again to make it look very neat. That is not um, no flyaways. You want it to look neat as possible. And I think I did this one. I think I only added three strands. I could have added some at the ends, but I did not. But this is the finished look, you guys. This is the style that I have it, like wearing it to the side. Or you can wear it like this that is not like in your face. So I think I like how it's like pulled back. But you guys see the look, the hair, and I love it. Tell me what you guys think down below. And don't forget to please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. And by the way, guys, don't forget to watch my other videos. And I'll see you guys.